First Business Brief for Wednesday, April 2nd. I'm Angela Miles. Plenty of tears but few answers came out of testimony on Capitol Hill by GM CEO Mary Barra. Barra apologized to the families of victims who lost their lives driving cars with ignition switch problems and promised to get answers. GM shares closed at $34, down just eight cents. Mixed signals are coming from the housing sector. U.S. home prices continue to rise at a steady pace. Sales rose 12.2 percent in February, topping January. However, construction spending barely budged, moving up just 0.1 percent as cold, snowy weather hammered the economy. And a vast majority of fast food workers report wage theft. According to a survey, 89 percent of workers say they've been asked to perform duties off the clock, denied breaks during long shifts, and more than 45 percent said that they've not been paid for all the hours they work. The stores are often run by franchise owners. That's a First Business Brief. I'm Angela Miles.